All right, Tumor Tales, boom! Hey, just wanna do a quick check-in. It's been, uh, been a little bit, been really, uh, really busy uh, living, L-I-V-I-N. And been feeling really good. So we kinda had like, a, I had a weird stomach thing. I always get nervous that it's uh, my diverticulosis slash uh, turning into diverticulitis which is a infection of the colon. Uh, if you want to look up that, if you don't know what it is, uh, it's basically, I'm going to oversimplify, but little, little, uh, little pockets uh, that have formed on your colon wall. And look it up, diverticulosis, diverticulitis. Um, anyway, so, but seem to have gotten through that and did uh, did it without uh, any antibiotics, just natural stuff, which is always awesome. I was a little bit nervous, thinking, oh, am I gonna have to, gonna have to go to the medicine cabinet? Uh, I did not, so I don't know, a lot of rest. Um, you know, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't a sloth or anything, you know, Job of the Hut style, but I definitely took it easy got plenty of sleep, didn't like overly exert myself. I've been doing a lot of CrossFit. Uh, just, you know, if I can do it, I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna keep hammering on it. Um, a CrossFit with my regiment of Fenbendazole, which I don't do every week. I'll do two or three weeks on and then I'll take a few weeks off and then go back on it. And I don't know that, you know, everyone do your own thing there. I don't, I don't have 100% clarity on whether that's gonna help or not, but I'm doing it because it's not hurting me that I know of. Uh, garlic, I try to eat garlic, raw garlic chopped up, let's sit for 15 minutes every day, turmeric, uh, uh, curcumin, curcumin, curcumin. I, I always say that word wrong. I, I could read it 100,000 times, I'll still say it wrong. Um, CBD oil, uh, blueberries, blackberries, fresh, organic, I'll eat those. Um, yada, yada, yada. So uh, today, the question I have today is this, and I'm not really, I don't know that anybody has an answer. Other, you know, they'll have answers, but um, I'm looking for opinions and then information. With all the these COVID vaccines that are coming out, they are supposed to be RNA uh, vaccines. Uh, does, uh, does anybody know anything about them? And are they, are they truly safe? Uh, what are the concerns? Uh, I'm not someone who, you know, I, I was vaccinated as a kid. Uh, my kids were vaccinated. I have become more interested, maybe skeptical. I don't know if that's the word, but in, in you know, why, why uh, people believe that the vaccines can cause autism in kids. So I've started to research that, you know, in full disclosure, it was nothing that was ever really a, a high priority to me, but it's, it's becoming um, something I'm more curious about the, as you know, my health has, uh, has become a, a higher priority. <laughs> Uh, you know, not, not drinking, you know, right now has been really good for me and, you know, just, uh, getting clarity and, and, you know, I didn't being able to, to, uh, rationalize things without, without, uh, without the negative effects and consequences of alcohol, which is a good thing. Um, the, you know, so anyway, so the, the COVID vaccines, I don't know if I want to take one, I'll be honest. I, if somebody asked me today if I'm going to take one, I'd probably say no, um, because I don't know enough. I don't know that there's enough information about what the side effects could be. Uh, am I going to judge you if you've taken it? No. Uh, if you want to judge me for not taking it, fine. <laughs> Get in line. I'm, I'm sure I've been judged for far worse. Uh, anyway, so that's that's the thought today. I might even do a little uh, little poll on that. Uh, what are your thoughts? Put it in the comment section. Uh, again, don't, don't, don't worry. There's no right or wrong answer in my opinion. And I'm sure we'll get a, uh, a very wide range of comments on this. But, uh, you know, and hopefully we don't get censored. And if you want to ask me what my number one concern right now, it's uh, the censoring of ideas. 
And I'm, I'm of the belief that, you know, we should protect all speech, especially the speech we don't agree with. And because uh, that's how we grow. And you know, I never know when I'm going to learn something. You know, a lot of times it's from hearing a, a point of view that I hadn't considered. So anyway, with that, I hope everyone's doing great. Uh, it's been a while. I'll, I'll make sure it's not so long next time. I hope you guys are all doing awesome. Uh, and uh, we'll see you soon. Boom. I'm out of here.